Well, for this show, I worked uh, with my my fiance, and there's a lot of uh, his family history in the show too. So we have, we've continued a dialogue um, for a while and concentrated it in the last few months on family history and family secrets. I don't concentrate so much on one theme. That's very new for me and I think it's because I was collaborating that I allowed myself to commit to one theme. So my, my other shows are like all over the place and I don't really know what they're about and by the end I start to discover something but this we really started out with some ideas. We really wanted to explore um, schizophrenia really and specifically explore um, that the, the definitions are actually quite vague um, between like madness and let's say someone who's a prophet and in researching the, um, the similarities, you know, a lot of schizophrenics have a very similar story to prophets in a way. They feel like a huge burden to save the world and that higher powers are speaking to them. So we find it kind of interesting, like in certain contexts, it's an insane person that belongs in an asylum from another perspective. It's someone that's considered like holy and becomes a sort of power figure. I'm working on a lot of different projects at the moment. Um, I'm working on a new record with my sister and we're also going to be doing an installation at the Marrakesh Biennial in Morocco in February. We're also curating a big festival in in Austria in the spring where I have uh, written and I'm directing a dance and that's a completely new adventure for me. Actually the dancer that's here tonight, Vino, he's the choreographer for the dance that I'm doing. And my sister's working on a kind of minimal opera and then we'll perform together and with a lot of other artists as well. Honestly, I haven't seen much, and um, but I do find this this particular space really inspiring. Um, I enjoy like a very extreme juxtaposition. So I had the like the the rainbow, the big rainbow projection, for instance. Even though there's a lot of rainbows in my work, that idea was very site specific after coming in here, and I. I think I enjoy the contrast with this sort of rigidity and rawness and grayness of the building. So, uh, definitely inspired my, my rainbow side. <laughs>